Yo, what's up everyone? Agent here again. So today I'm gonna show you what the title says. How to add a scrolling text on your PS4 streams. You won't need a capture card, a remote play method, nor OBS. See guys, no clickbait. So if you checked out the tutorial before this one, how to get a live sub count on PS4 streams, it's almost the exact same process. Alright, so let's just get into this video already. So first things first, you need the PlayStation 4 camera. There are two different versions, the VR version and the regular one, but it doesn't matter which one you use. You can't do this without the PS4 camera. Alright, now that we got the camera out of the way, now you need the laptop. I don't know if a phone or anything else but a computer will work for this. Just try to figure it out but anyway on the laptop you're gonna go on a website called codepen.io okay it's in the description and I have a template ready for you guys and anybody can use it it's basic and has everything you need basically has drop a like leave a comment you know where I'm going it slides and goes into a cycle of rotations okay so now you just take your PlayStation camera and you put it in front of the laptop okay I'm gonna show you how to tweak this a little but I'm gonna take a clip from my live sub count video because it's basically the same process so now you want to press the share button on your PS4 remote. A menu should open up and you want to press on sharing and broadcasting settings. After that, another menu opens up. Now you press on broadcast settings. Then a small menu opens up. Now you want to press on advanced settings. And then we have another menu. Press on camera video settings. All right, really quick guys. So in this flashback clip, basically, I'm talking about the sub count. But whenever you see the sub count in the pictures that you're gonna see later or hear me say sub count, it also works for the sliding text or just whatever screen you have on your laptop. So if there's any confusion on this part coming up, let me know in the comments. I am gonna respond to every single one. Okay, so this is where you wanna be. You can see a preview of the sub count before you start up the stream. Now press square to see it in full size and here you can adjust your camera's position and see how much you want of your screen to be in there. Now back to the menu just press square again. You can play around with the brightness, contrast and stuff like that of how you want it to be displayed. Alright so we're back to the current clip again. So this will make your stream look better appearance wise and if people see a scrolling text with the formal PS4 stream overlay they're gonna look at it and see what it says because it's different than the standard PS4 streams. But anyway I hope this helped you guys out and I'll see you all later.